guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is much requested one so you guys have been asking me about my hair care routine I am so sorry for the for the random noise of airplanes because I stay very very close to the airport and there's a plane crossing every two minutes so that's something I really can't help and this is a video about my hair care routine so what are the products that I use do I blow dry my hair do I don't so I'll be sharing all my secrets with you today in this video and I have my product lineup here so which I'll share one by one what are the products that I use first product is a hair oil I personally love to put coconut oil in my hair but the only difficulty with coconut oil is that it's really hard to take off out from your hair so you need to shampoo your hair a lot more to get coconut oil off your hair so that's why I prefer to use some alternatives you know that ring raj is a very very good ingredient in your hair oils and and we all know that it smells horrible but i've been using the kama hair fall therapy or the hair oil for the longest time but recently i stumbled upon this one this is called kesra it's a herbal oil from gulnar skincare i don't know how you, you pronounce it as gulnar or gulnar but but this one's uh, almost half the price of kama and it does almost the same job though a uh, warning when you're using this oil is that don't go close to anyone because it really smells horrible that's with all the bring raj oils there is but this actually acts as a hair conditioner so once you use it put it in your hair not for too long not for overnight say about two three hours and then maybe just wash it off with the shampoo and not even use a conditioner and your hair would be like amazing okay um now if i i don't have access to that or if you find that's too expensive for you the uh, the other option which i ordered over amazon i guess is the himalaya anti hair fall oil this also has the bringraj ingredient but i'm not too sure in the same quantity but yeah i think this one also does a good job on my hair once you have oiled your hair you absolutely need to wash it so there are a lot of shampoos available in the market and you know when you look at them some some shampoo promises hair fall uh, rescue some say damage re repair and this and that but tried everything been there done that and i finally settled on this one which again i ordered which i think you get in most stores these days but if you don't get it uh, in your nearest store you can find it on amazon i will share a link below this is a shampoo from Tony and Guy and this is a shampoo for dry hair but what I really love about this shampoo is that you really don't have to use a conditioner after this I mean you could just go ahead and use the shampoo and that would be it but if you want your hair to be a little extra smooth and shiny then you can use a conditioner it doesn't dry your hair this one retails about 800 bucks so it's tad little expensive but the quantity of shampoo you would use is very very less so actually i think this bottle on my hair which i wash like three times a week this bottle lasts me about two months which i think is very very economical if you look at it and the fact that it makes your hair look so good that you really don't have to use a lot of serum as well okay this so um I am somebody who would use any conditioner that's available to me. Uh, I really loved the Dove options, the one which came in a tube, but I think they've discontinued it. So currently I am on a hunt to look for the favorite conditioner. But something uh, I've been using recently is this uh, Organic Harvest Hair Spa. Okay. So uh, something I've been recently using is the Organic Harvest Hair Spa. This one again retails around $8.95. Okay, but uh, you have to use it only twice a week. I actually use it once a week. I think if they say you have to use it twice a week, but I think I use it just once a week. Uh, and you know, you put it in your hair and you have to wait for 5-7 minutes. So I usually put it in my hair and sit in the steam room for a bit again does wonders if your hair is damaged like mine are because i don't know if you know three years ago i was a complete golden blonde so i pre-bleached my hair not once but twice the tips of my hair are not that great still so i need some damage repair happening there 
So this is my lifesaver when it comes to that. Once you washed your hair, you definitely need to condition it. So the serum I am currently using and loving is again from Tony and Guy. This is the Glamour Serum Drops, which is high shine and polish. Loving it. I bought it off a store, but you can buy it on Amazon. I'm, I'm going to drop the link in the description below. What I love is that this retails at 650, which is not super expensive. And I use two pumps in these hair. <laughs> so I think again, it, it would last me at least three months. So yeah, with my hair. So yeah, I think again, something very economical. I usually have a habit of washing my hair and then sleeping off. And then the next morning when I wake up, I wake up with the most horrible hair. And that's where I have a problem detangling them. So sometimes what I use is this detangling spray from, uh, this is from Body Shop. I bought it off the store, uh, but you, I think you can, Body Shop also sells online. So I'll check in, the link it below in the description box. This one retails at about 900 bucks. This is Rainforest Radiance Detangling Spray for colored hair. Uh, why did I buy colored hair option? Okay, because I was colored long time ago, so yeah. But this is something that's a saving grace if you want to detangle your hair. Blow drying. A word about blow drying. Do I blow dry my hair? 99.99% of the times I don't. I air dry them. And um, well, I've already told you that I don't blow dry my hair. That means next day I have to do something with them, which usually means I would curl them like I did today or I would straighten them out. In both the cases, I try to use a heat protection spray. I Currently, I'm using the Pantene Pro-V version, which I don't remember where I bought from, but uh, I think I'll find. It should be available on Amazon. I will check and link it below. I think I bought it for five, 600 bucks, maybe. But uh, I spray it in my hair and then I walk around the house and do my stuff. For a couple of minutes come back and that's where it's done the hairspray now this is something i've been using for the longest time again i don't remember where i bought it from i think i bought it from dubai or bangkok i don't remember but this is available in india most stores have it most and amazon has it of course this is uh, all weather tuft by Schwarzkopf, and this is mega strong because my hair strands really thick and I need to have that extra hold. So this is the hairspray that I use 90% of the times. <laughs> We're done. Okay, there's one more product I'd like you to see. It's super, super frizzy. Then I highly recommend this uh, Techie Art Liz Control from L'Oreal Paris. This retails at 575. You can get it at any L'Oreal store. You can get it at any L'Oreal salon. I bought it from a L'Oreal salon, uh, but you should get it on Amazon. I'll again check back with you with the links, but you need to use like a coin sized thing after you've taken your shower. It's like a after conditioner or a leave in conditioner sort of a thing, but it just leaves your hair so smooth that you know you'll absolutely be in love with your hair after you've done this but it's this one i don't use a lot because my hair is not that frizzy they are they're towards the oily sides so yeah but when they're behaving really bad that's where i use this for rescue so this is it guys thank you so much for watching this video i hope you, if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up please do subscribe to my channel i make videos every week and i